Okie dokie, artichokey. Good morning, birds. It's cold in here this morning. How's everybody doing today on this beautiful sunny day after so much rain? So let's go ahead and jump right in with virtual toddler story time. Hi, my name is Sam. We're gonna start out with our hand washing song, okay? So a deep breath for me. All right, so we do top and bottom, top and bottom, in between, in between. Scruff them both together, scruff them both together. Now they're clean, squeaky clean. Top and bottom, top and bottom, in between, in between. Scruff them both together, scruff them both together. Now they're clean, squeaky clean. All right, let's take our squeaky clean hands and say good morning in English and in Spanish, okay? And good afternoon and good evening. So we say, good morning, good morning. How are you? How are you? Very well, thank you. Very well, thank you. How about you? How about you? Buenos dias, buenos dias. Como estas? Como estas? Muy bien, gracias. Muy bien, gracias. Si usted, y usted. And then good afternoon. Good afternoon, good afternoon. How are you? How are you? Very well, thank you. Very well, thank you. How about you? How about you? Buenas tardes, buenas tardes. Como estas? Como estas? Muy bien, gracias. Muy bien, gracias. Si usted y usted. And good evening. Good evening, good evening. How are you? How are you? Very well, thank you. Very well, thank you. How about you? How about you? And last in Spanish. Buenas noches, buenas noches. Como estas? Como estas? Muy bien, gracias. Muy bien, gracias. Si usted y usted. All right, good morning and welcome to Virtual Toddler Story Time. So now that we've washed our hands and said good morning and good afternoon and good evening in English and Spanish, let's do today's felt board song. I thought we would do the five little ducks because we read about ducks last week and we haven't done the duck song in a while. So let's do this one. So we're gonna do the five little ducks. So for this one, do you remember? We say that five little ducks went out one day over the hill and far away. Mother duck said quack, 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 but only four little ducks came back. Oh no, where did they go? So next, ooh, next we say four little ducks went out one day over the hill and far away. Mother duck said quack, 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 but only three little ducks came back. <gasps> where did they go? So next, we have three little ducks went out one day over the hill and far away. Mother duck said quack, 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 but only two little ducks came back. So two little ducks went out one day over the hill and far away. Mother duck said quack, 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 but only one little duck came back. Oh no! One little duck went out one day over the hill and far away. Mother duck said quack, 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 quack. But this time, no little ducks came back. Now I don't want you to worry. The little ducks found a nice big juicy worm while they were out on the hill and that's why they didn't come back. But they're totally fine, okay? They will come back to mama later. All right, so thank you for counting down from five with me. We did one, two, three, four, five little duckies, plus one mama, which makes six ducks. 
All right, so thank you for counting down from five with me. So I think now, because my hands are so cold, it's so cold in here today, I think I wanna do, I wake up my hands so we can get them nice and warm, okay? So what we're gonna do is another deep breath. And we're gonna say, I wake up my hands with a clap, 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 a clap, 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 a clap, clap, clap. I wake up my hands with a clap, 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 and I wiggle my waggles away. Whoop, I got my ukulele right there. Let's wiggle those waggles away. So next we say, I wake up my eyes with a blink, 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 a blink, 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 a blink, blink, blink. I wake up my eyes with a blink, 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 and I wiggle my waggles away. What should we wake up next? I wake up my shoulders with a shrug, 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 a shrug, 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 a shrug, shrug, shrug. I wake up my shoulders with a shrug, 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 and I wiggle my waggles away. Let's do I wake up my feet with a stomp, 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 a stomp, 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 a stomp, stomp, stomp. I wake up my feet with a stomp, 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 and I wiggle my waggles away. You know, my hands are still cold, so let's wake up our hands even more with something else. I wake up my fingers with a wiggle, 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 a wiggle, 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 a wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. I wake up my fingers with a wiggle, 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 and I wiggle my waggles away. And lastly, I wake up my belly with a beep, 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 a beep, 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 a beep, beep, beep. I wake up my belly with a beep, 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 and I wiggle my waggles away. Good job, everybody. All right, let's do one more song before we read our book. And I just realized that I left my book on the table back there. So I'm gonna have to stand up and go get it. But just a minute, I'm gonna do that after we sing our next song, okay? All right, let's take another deep breath. <sighs> Wiggling my waggles away always makes me breathe kind of hard. Let's do another deep breath. <sighs> Excellent. All right, so this next one is a song about rain and sunshine, okay? So we're gonna do this two times through because it's been a long time since we've done this song. So for this one, it's called Rain is Falling Down. We're gonna go, rain is falling down, splash. Rain is falling down, splash. Pitter patter, pitter patter. Rain is falling down, splash. Sun is peeking out, peek. Sun is peeking out, peek. Peeking here, peeking there. Sun is peeking out, peek. All right, so let's do that one one more time, okay? So if you're doing this with a baby at home, this is a really fun one to do with baby laying in your lap facing you. And when we do rain is falling down, we can gently tickle our fingers down, baby and then splash, it's just a gentle sweep across their belly. And then obviously peekaboo is really fun for kids as well, but this is a good one for babies and toddlers alike. All right, so let's do this one one more time. So we're gonna do, rain is falling down, splash. Rain is falling down, splash. Pitter patter, pitter patter. Rain is falling down, splash. Sun is peeking out, peek. Sun is peeking out, peek. Peeking here, peeking there. Sun is peeking out, peek. All right, thank you for singing that song with me. So like I said, I just remembered I left my book on the table. So I'm gonna stand up and go grab my book real quick and then we'll be back to read today's book, okay? Just one second. Okay, okie 
Doki Artichoke. I guess that's my catchphrase now. Have you read that book? That's a really cute book. All right, so today's book is kind of long, so we're not gonna sing many songs after this one because it's gonna take a minute to get through. But for today, oh, let me switch the screen so that you can see what I'm reading. Man, I'm just all over the place today, huh? There we go. Okay, perfect. <laughs> Sorry about that. And now it's shaking. Oh, what a beautiful day. All right. So today we are going to read Birdhouse for Rent. This is written by Harriet Ziefert, and the paintings are done by Donald Dreyfus. And this is read with permissions from Houghton Mifflin Company, okay? So Birdhouse for Rent. We say, I, let's do it on this side so you can see better. I am a birdhouse. I was put in the ground at the beginning of July. As you can see, I am vacant. I have no tenants but there's a cat. All summer, lots of birds flew over my roof. Some even stopped to rest. I was sure the bluebird who landed on my perch would come in, but he did not. A starling poked his beak in my doorway, but he didn't step inside. Finally, in September, I had tenants. They were wasps. I could hear the wasps hum as they built a paper nest on my ceiling. Just look at it. It's amazing. That is an amazing nest. In October, when the weather got cold, the wasps left. Chipmunks moved in. Oh, what messy tenants. The chipmunks dragged in leaves, grass, sticks, and more acorns than I could count. After a few weeks, I was ready for the chipmunks to leave, but they stayed all winter. November was blowy. In December, it rained a lot. January was icy and heavy snow fell in February. Unfortunately, a March storm snapped my post. Oh no! Fortunately, the chipmunks vacated. In early April, a farmer put me on top of a new post. A few house hunting birds stopped by, but they didn't stay. One day, a chickadee peeked in my doorway. He hopped all over my roof and examined me from all angles. He seemed to find everything to his liking. He called to another bird who was perched on a nearby branch. I thought, oh, that must be Mrs. Chickadee. She came right over. She saw the place was snug and dry. The entrance was well above the floor, better for keeping out wind, rain, and enemies. She seemed pleased. And so they moved in. At first, Mr. and Mrs. Chickadee spent most of their days out of the house finding insects. But after a week or two, she stayed close to home and he did the food collecting. Mrs. Chickadee was building a nest. After three days of hard work, Mrs. Chickadee nestled down the next morning, I heard Mr. Chickadee calling softly. Mrs. Chickadee gave him an eager welcome, but did not get up. When she arched her back to reach for a nice juicy caterpillar, I saw an egg. The next day, there was another egg. The next, another, and then another. Finally, after 10 eggs in 10 days, Mrs. Chickadee was done. Can we count those? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten whole eggs. That's a lot of eggs, Mrs. Chickadee. Good job. For weeks, Mrs. Chickadee had been spending nearly all of her time inside the house. Now she stayed outside all day, leaving her eggs deserted. But she didn't cover or but she did cover them before she flew off. Good job, Mrs. Chickadee. So an egg thief wouldn't eat them. 
Unfortunately, the farmer's cat was too smart for Mrs. Chickadee, and I watched him steal three of her eggs. Finally, the eggs started to hatch. After two days, there were seven baby birds. The babies always had their mouths wide open, begging to be fed. Altogether, I counted 600 feedings a day. That's a lot of food. When the babies were a few days old, the cat returned, looking for more to eat. Mr. and Mrs. Chickadee made a lot of noise and chased him away. Phew, the babies were safe. That's a relief. As the babies grew, the place became quite crowded. I could hear little chip, chip, chips all day long, as if the babies were saying, when can we go outside? And they did in early June when they were big and plump and could fly. They came in and out for a few days, then they left my house completely. I wonder who the next tenants will be. The end. All right, so when we read a book at You Kind Story Time, we hold it up above our heads. We say, hip, hip, hooray. I read one book today. All right, so because this was a kind of long book, we're just gonna do a couple more songs and a rhyme, and then we will do our goodbye song, and then I will give you a little bit of news for the day. All right, so let's do the rhyme, and then we will do a couple songs with the ukulele, okay? So for our rhyme, we're gonna do way up high on the apple tree. This is another one we haven't done in a long time, so I will do it two times through. Alrighty, so a deep breath for me. Most excellent. And we're gonna do way up high in the apple tree. Two little apples smiled at me. I shook that tree as hard as I could. And down came the apples. Mmm, they were good. All right, so let's do that one more time, all right? We go way up high in the apple tree. Two little apples smiled at me. I shook that tree as hard as I could. And down came the apples. Mmm, they were good. All right, so let's go ahead and do, what else grows on trees? Oh, pears, let's do pears. So way up high in the pear tree, two little pears smiled at me. I shook that tree as hard as I could, and down came the pears. Mmm, they were good. What else? Let's do cherries. So way up high in the cherry tree, two little cherries smiled at me. I shook that tree as hard as I could, and down came the cherries. Mmm, they were good. All right, good job, everybody. All right, so we're going to do just a couple songs, two songs. Let's do a rainbow song today. So we've done this one before, but I'll still do it two times through. Once nice and slow, and once a little bit faster, okay? Although my hands are really cold, so it might be kind of hard for me to actually play the ukulele today. But we're gonna do it anyway. All right, so we're gonna do... <gasps> Deep breath. <sighs> Good job. We're gonna do red and green and yellow and blue. These are the colors over you. Red like the sun and blue like the sea. Red, what? <laughs> yellow like the, okay. We're gonna start over again. I just completely lost my spot, okay. Red and green and yellow and blue, these are the colors over you. Red like an apple, blue like the... You guys, today is not a good day for the singing, but that's okay. One more time. Let's start over again. We say red and green and yellow. Oh my gosh.
gosh, that was hard today. Okay, let's do it again. I think we're gonna stick with the slow one today because clearly I'm having a hard time remembering the words to this song. So we're just gonna go nice and slow and take it easy. Here we go. Red and green. times through without messing up. Yay! All right, so let's go ahead. Oh, you know what? One more song. Let's do the more we get together and the more we read together. All right, now this one's really easy. Hopefully this one I can remember the words to. All right, so we're gonna do the more we get together 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 the more we get together the happier we'll be for your friends are my friends and your friends. The more we get together, the happier we'll be. The more we read together, together, together. The more we read together, the happier we'll be. Read big books and small books and short books and tall books. The more we read together, the happier we'll be. Should we do that one more time? Let's do them both one more time. Another deep breath. Okay. The more we get together, 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 the more we get together, the happier we'll be. For your friends are my friends, and my friends are your friends. The more we get together, the happier we'll be. The more we read together, together, I could remember the words to that one, just not the rainbow song. That's okay. We'll do it again next week and hopefully I'll remember them that time. All right, so let's go ahead and do the goodbye train and then I have a little bit of news for today. So one more deep breath for me and make this the deepest one you've got, okay? Wiggle some of those waggles out and we're gonna do Oh, the goodbye train is leaving, see you soon, too, too. The goodbye train is leaving, see you soon, too, too. The goodbye train is leaving, the goodbye train is leaving, oh, the goodbye train is leaving, see you soon, too, too. So we'll say goodbye to story time for now, bye, bye. We'll say goodbye to story time for now, bye, bye. We'll say goodbye to story time, say goodbye to story time. We'll say goodbye to story time for now. Bye bye. All right. Thank you for bearing with me while I had this chaotic story time today. All right. So for some news, um, oh, excuse me. <clears throat> so I am going to be out of the library next week. So uh, the last week of November, there will be no full steam ahead and there will be no toddler story time. Um, I hope you enjoy uh, the week and you have a wonderful holiday if you are celebrating the holiday this year. Um, I hope that you are all able to stay safe and I will see you again the first week of December for the normal scheduled full steam ahead and virtual toddler story time programming. Um, I do have three no, four early literacy backpacks available. If you would like to give us a call and schedule a curbside pickup for one of those backpacks, we would love to do that for you. Just a reminder, the backpacks come with five picture books. They may be fiction or they may be nonfiction, but they are all picture books, as well as a laminated song and rhyme sheet for your very own story time enjoyment at home. Um, a DVD or CD that is following the theme of the books, as well as one educational game. Um, and then also the last piece of news, we do now have um, 1000 Books Before Kindergarten available online. Um, so if you are interested in signing up a child age zero to five, 
you are more than welcome to head over to mendolibrary.beanstack or yes, mendolibrary.beanstack. <laughs> um, so that is M-E-N-D-O-L-I-B-R-A-R-Y dot B-E-A-N-S-T-A-C-K. Uh, Mendo Library at Beanstack.org. I don't know why I just had the hardest time remembering that URL. My brain is just everywhere today. So yeah, it's Mendo Library at Beanstack.org. So if you would like to sign up, you can go ahead and head over there and do that. Um, if you have been keeping track of the books that you're reading with your under kindergarten crowd, um, you are more than welcome to log the ones that you've been reading while we shelter in place, um, especially if you signed up beforehand and have been unable to continue um, during the sheltering place order. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to give us a call at the library and we can go ahead and help you out. Uh, and one more time, thank you for <laughs> sticking around while my brain has just been everywhere during this story time today. It's so cold in here. I'm having a hard time focusing, guys. All right, anyway, I will see you not next week, but the following week, the first week of December, and we will be back to our normal programming schedule, okay? I hope you have a wonderful day, and um, as I said before, I hope you are able to have fun and stay safe during the Holloway holiday week if you are planning to celebrate. I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.